So just a quick tour of my home theater down here. Wanted to stop at the sub panel first. Um, right now the rack is hooked up to its own dedicated lines. Subwoofers, there'll be three of them. Each has its own dedicated line also. This side right here, that is for the LED lighting that is behind in the walls, not where the screen is. Close this up. And right here is going to be the entrance to the theater. Some home little posters, but this is the rack. It's a U42 Middle Atlantic. Uh, right now I'm using the Marinance SR8015. I do have a trim off on order, so I'll be relocating that or giving it away. Um, for clean power, just using the Panamax for right now. So I'm able to switch that up. For my DVD player, it is the UV9000, which is just awesome. I love it. I'll give a better tour of that probably later on. Uh, right now, the movie posters. Joker, totally signed by all of the cast. Uh, we'll go to Karate Kid, also signed. Uh, my favorite, one I've always wanted, original Star Wars Return of the Jedi. Just a great poster. Just finished off this basement, so still got a lot of work to do. Here's the theater room. And this will just be a quick tour using Martin Logan all the way around. The Epson 6050, that's actually going to be upgraded to the JVC by the end of the year. The uh, reason I picked these Martin Logans right here, because this will end up going to my living room. I have a mind of what I want for an upgrade. SVS PB4000. There's actually going to be another one over here, PB4000. And in the back over here, because everything's got a dedicated line. Right there, I'm going to have more than likely the Martin Logan 212 Dual 12. Um, for a screen, I am using the Elite Aeon 135. Really good. So over here for the towers, Martin Logan's... 60 XTI, the 50 XTI, just absolutely love the way these sound. Um, as I was saying, the LED lighting you can't really see, but we made like a little nook so the lights go behind it all the way around. I did not want the LED lightings behind the screen because it just made no sense to me at all. There's also lighting on the riser. Uh, don't mind the shitty couches. Just waiting on theater chairs now. For colors, I went with the tricorn black in the back, ceiling door to the front, and then peppercorn gray on the sides. So that's really it for my quick theater. Uh, dimensions, ceilings, eight and a half feet. Uh, the width is 17 feet. All the way from front to back is about 20 and a half feet. Good size room. Totally love it. My seating area back wise, it's about 11 feet from the screen. It's actually great. Top seating is going to be good too. It's going to be rows of three and three. That's about it for right now. But I'm trying to get a little better on these.